Welcome to Wessex Garages on Panath Road in Cardiff. Here today we have a Kia Sportage Level 3 Sat Nav, which comes on a 63 plate and is in the techno orange colour. It's a 1.7 litre diesel engine with a 6 speed manual gearbox. Some great features to show you around on the model, and if you feel like you'd like to book yourself a test drive, you can do this on our website www.wessexgarages.co.uk. Or you can pop in store to us at 289 Wessex Garages on Panath Road in Cardiff. You can see at the front of the Kia we've got a chrome surround on the front grille. Also have chrome strips above the front fog lights. We have LED daytime running lights and projection headlights. Down the side of the model we've got body curved wing mirrors with integrated indicators and chrome exterior door handles. There's also a chrome strip at the bottom side of the window that flicks up at the back. This gives it a nice design feature especially matched with the chrome handles. If I show you here we've got the Kia alloy wheels which you can see there they are in good condition and they're really nicely designed. They've got the Kia badge in the centre. Heading around the back of the model now, I'll open up the boot and show you the storage space provided. And as you can see there, we've got a nice wide entry into the boot, good hydraulic arms, so you don't have to do too much of the lifting when opening up the boot. If I get closer, you see it's a flat entry, so there's nothing to lift your items over. And we also have a 12 volt in the back as well as a light on the left hand side. You have got the added option of having 60-40 folding rear seats so you can make additional space if you feel like there isn't enough here for you. And we got the boot cover that goes straight over the top there as well. Now I'll show you some of the external features. I'll show you the back of the car first before I make my way into the front. And the first thing you'll notice is it is a full leather interior. It's a really nice quality as well. We've got white stitching, which if I zoom in there, you can see how well the stitch is done. The central armrest, if pulled out, has two additional cup holders on it for the rear passengers. And we also have rear seats in the rear. <laughs> we also have heated seats, sorry, in the back which can be activated with the own with everyone's own control on the door themselves. We also have chrome interior door handles on all four. Now we're on the inside of the car. I'll let you have a little look around before I point out any of the features. As you can see on the right hand side on the door we have all four electric window controls. We also have central lock in electric wing mirrors which are easy to tuck in as there is a button which tucks both wing mirrors in for you. You also have start stop technology on the model and hill descent control available on the right hand side of the steering wheel. And just behind the steering wheel we have automatic windscreen wipers and automatic headlights. On the right hand side of the steering wheel you have cruise control fitted where you're able to set a reserve, cancel and then further down the bottom so our Bluetooth connection with voice recognition which you can easily use if you just press the button there you can then say who you'd like to call it will then go for your phone book and make the phone call for you. On the left hand side then we have our music controls with volume mute source and channel select. As you can see here we have an a built-in sat-nav and mp3 player. This comes with an AM and FM frequency radio, mp3 compatible CD player and you can also stream music via the built-in auxiliary and USB socket. Just at the bottom here you can see there you can stream it directly from your device with the use of just one wire. There's also a 12 volt and your parking sensors to activation button on the right hand side. 
the model does come with dual climate control which as you can see there I can change the temperature on the left side of the car compared to the right this means if you're driver and the passenger they can have two different temperatures saving on the arguing as we all know that can happen further down the center console we have our heated seats controls as well which like as I said in the front of the car we have two different temperature controls and then further back is our six-speed gearbox two additional cup holders and storage space available within the armrest we have central locking controls on the passenger side door as well as the bottle holders at the bottom in the change pocket and in the glove box there we have an air conditioning vent as well one last feature that I haven't mentioned sorry is if you look above me we have actually got a built-in panoramic sunroof you can see there's a window in the back as well which is currently covered over because the roof is open but if I just press that there it will close the roof and you can see the window at the back now that's a great feature to have especially on hot days such as today they may not come around often but when they are here it's great to take full effect from them this Kia Sport has just done 8,312 miles we have some great finance packages available on this model and if you're to reserve it online you would receive an additional discount